Hi, this is Doug Shields with Clear One's Technical Training Department, and today we'd like to show you the use of the Min Max tabs. I'm going to open up a processing channel in this 880T, and in the processing channel you can see there's a little yellow arrow at the maximum plus 20 gain setting, and I can drag that into a different setting. In this case, I've drug it into a maximum value of plus 10 dB. There's another arrow at the minimum, minus 65, and that can be adjusted, and I'm going to drag it into minus 10 dB. That means that I now have limited the range of adjustment when using a control system or using our ramp commands or our relative gain commands to a range of plus 10 to minus 10. These min-max tabs are available in many of the faders in our units, including the processing channels. They're available on the outputs. You see them there. You see them on the telco transmit. You see them also on our fader groups. And they're actually also on the inputs. Now we don't recommend the use of them on the inputs because we'd like you to set the inputs up and optimize it for the type and source of the input. Once those are set, those probably should stay relatively unchanged. But the places that we allow you and would desire for you to change your levels and adjust levels either internally or from the control system, those would be at the processing blocks, they'd be at the fader groups, they'd be at the outputs, and those would all be valid points to allow us to limit the range of adjustment within the Converge console. Thanks and good programming.